Erlov. Bid fear. Forgera? The English could attack at any time. You have some walls already, but you should complete them as soon as you have enough stone. Control groups make it easier to manage your units. With a group of units selected, press the left bumper to open the control uh, group menu. Kid. Target the tile where you want your wall to start and hold A whilst panning the camera to drag it out. Release A to confirm the wall's placement. If you have surplus resources of one type, you can sell them for gold at your market. You can then use the gold to buy what you need. To build a castle, you must first advance to the next age, the Castle Age. You may need a gate to let your troops in and out of town. Find the Build Stone Gate command in the Villager's Command menu. Kid. Erlov. Kia Nianaga Parker Bit fear. Air love. 
ನಿನಗೆ ಫೋರ್ಗರ ಥ್ರೆಬಾಕ್ ಥ್ರೆಬಾಕ್ ಹಿದ್ ಥ್ರೆಬಾಕ್ ಅರ್ಲವ್ ಪೂನಿದ್ ಪೂನಿದ್ ಫೋರ್ಗರೆ ಬೀಜ್ ಫೀರ್ fear air love beat fear air love
Kid, Trebach. Forgere, To. Kia, Treba. Kia, Boonage. Erlov, Bid Fear. Kid, Bid Fear. Forgere, Boonage. Kia, Kid. Forgere, Boonage. Bonit. Tau. Arlov. Bonit. Bit dear. You have enough resources to go to the castle age. You should do that soon.
Ikea. Bargara, Gert. Rabuga. Congratulations! You're going to find lots of things to do in the Castle Age. For starters, try building a siege workshop to make battering rams and other siege weapons. This river crossing would be a good spot to place a navigation waypoint. Navigation waypoints allow you to quickly jump between key locations, such as choke points. To place a navigation waypoint, target your desired location with the reticle, hold the left trigger, and press the right stick. You may need to assign extra villagers to gather stone, so you'll have enough to build the castle and all the fortifications you need. Forgera. Rabuigia. Good job. With your new siege workshop, you can make battering rams. Rams are slow, but they are resistant to arrow fire and excellent at knocking down walls. You may need some rams to attack the English castle. Great, you have completed the castle. Sir William should be here soon, and then it will be time to attack the English. Wallace has come.
One of your most powerful units is created at the castle. Kid? Create ten more wood raiders. Bead fear. Forger. Erlov. Trebach. With William Wallace and his wood raiders on your side, the English may be in trouble. Once you have a large army with plenty of siege weapons, go destroy the English castle. Kia? Beat fear. Here. Near Trebuchets are massive siege weapons with a great range, available only in the Imperial Age. Remember that trebuchets must be packed to move and unpacked to fire. Nienige.
The Advanced Commands in a military unit's command menu allow access to new formation types. For example, with a box formation, you can protect a weak unit, such as a monk. The formation buttons are available when you have multiple military units selected. The Advanced Commands let you set combat states for your soldiers. A defensive soldier will be less likely to attack an enemy that comes near him. You can also command a soldier to patrol an area between two points and guard or follow another unit. Bit fear. To. Dan kan. Bid fear. To. To. Kerglav. Don Kat.
Bid fear. Air love. Kogo! Kogo! Bargere. Tom!
English castle at Falkirk is no more. The English pretensions in Scotland are surely at an end. The forces of Wallace are triumphant. It looks certain that we would be defeated at Falkirk. Yet somehow, though outnumbered and outranged by English longbows, we were victorious. The English castle was torn down, and a Scottish one should be built in its place. William Wallace has shown us the path to victory. Although he is but one man, he inspires great deeds in others. Many of the Scottish knights and lords have drawn their swords with his. Wallace's own sword is a five and a half foot beast, forced of course in Scotland. He has swore not to rest until his sword finds the neck of Edward Longshanks. The struggle will continue, but we have learned the ways of war. Now, it is the English who will prove here.